Edvotec instructional videos, staining agarose gels using insta-stain ethidium bromide. For this experiment, you will need an agarose gel, electrophoresis buffer, an ultraviolet transilluminator, and insta-stain ethidium bromide. Always wear gloves and goggles when performing this experiment. Step 1. Slide the gel off of the casting tray onto a piece of plastic wrap on a flat surface. Step 2. Moisten the gel with a few drops of electrophoresis buffer. Step 3. Wearing gloves, remove and discard the clear protective sheet from the Instastain card. Step 4. Place the Instastain ethidium bromide card on the gel face down. With a gloved hand, remove any air bubbles between the card and the gel by gently running your fingers over the entire surface. Step 5. Place the casting tray on top of the card. Place a small weight, like an empty beaker, on top of the casting tray to ensure that the Instastain Ethidium Bromide card is in direct contact with the gel surface. Stain the gel for 3 to 5 minutes. Step 6. Remove the Instastain Ethidium Bromide card. Visualize the gel using an ultraviolet transilluminator. The DNA should appear as bright orange bands on a dark background. If the bands appear faint, repeat staining with a fresh Instastain card for an additional 3 to 5 minutes. The Instastain Ethidium Bromide cards and stained gels should be discarded using institutional guidelines for solid chemical waste.